I'm on level 48. I'd like to avoid fighting those Agnes guys for now. I do need to fight more of those Urchons, though. The Agnes guys look like they're going to be much higher level than I'm expected to be at the current moment. Yeah, we just participated in a topple race. Love the moment of Xenoblade. Rex shows it's it's ballin' time, balls all over Mouse. <laughs> Urchons no more. It's because they're all level 46. I probably won't get too overleveled if I fight them. I'll take a look and see if there's anything else in this area first. I found it! I found the something else in this area. It's a giant dinosaur. <laughs> Fusing a Cavessi and Agni and Ferranis together? This is inconceivable. I hear there's a Mobius who researches for honest flame clocks, developing experimental tech and what have you. Might be his handiwork that this was based on. Yeah, but you know what? No, what? It must have taken a lot of engineering to make it work. I'm really curious. Wish we could bring it back for analysis. Uh oh, here comes Shulk's fatal weakness. I agree, Shulk, sir. I want to study it, too. Don't encourage him. I love these affinity points. Ooh. Fancy. Ah, there it is. Mysterious fragment. 55. That's a bit much for us to handle right now. As is that. There is more. There's other level 50 stuff over in that that away. As well. And an ether at point as well. <sighs> Come back when level 50. Understood. I'm wondering if this is the post-game area. What level is the party right now? I should be able to hang build that Agnes camp. Although it's apparently not actually a camp. I just need to fight outside in order to get inside. We'll come back when story enemies, I think, start hitting level 50. But yeah, the one last construction point I'm expecting that somewhere down here is a um, a construction point for one of those projectors. Okay, we're here. Hey, these are what? Hey, Emerald Snow. chest up here. Could be up here actually. Yeah, it looks like it is. This this is a uh, off the beaten this is off the beaten trail apparently. Careful not to fall. Relic time. What do we get? Accessory unlock kit. No drop on still no. And 10% power charge when evading. That might be good on Shulk. Recharge speed when non-defenders are targeted. This was useful and broken in the base game if you wanted to build a no-tank party. I don't know if it's as useful here, though, because we we can't build a no-tank party. And Rex. Ooh, good. Finally. Perfect. Accessory slot. Looks like we're getting a lot of these.
I'm stronger now. I'm stronger now. All right. This strength will shape the future. Do the A. So what what is available on you that I want? Aggro every second. That's pretty good. Let's see if there's any better aggro things. Blocking adds fifty percent chance to absorb the ether attack. Block rate max HP. Uh, increases damage reduction while blocking. Yeah. Okay. So you don't get any other aggro boosting. So I'm just gonna throw this on you. I can get stronger. God. I've been playing Battle Network in my off time, uh, and I'm like super into the habit of saving anytime I do anything now. <laughs> Thanks, Battle Network. I hope we get a new Battle Network someday with more modern game design. <laughs> I like Battle Network, but who boy, is it an old video game? Hello, Turkey. They don't look all that tall. Hello, moving the camera because moving the camera is on a button you can hit normally. The outcome was patently obvious. Somewhere over there is a dude. I have to assume, though, that's up there somewhere. I don't know, it looks weird. It might be up here, too. We have other quotes, please. <laughs> Self aware. Ooh. Let's not linger on it. We have the advantage here. Prayer, Arya! First strike to me. Arya, keep at it. In the three words. Double starting Oh no, I got aggroed by a piece of wood? Watch out, that piece of wood's got some serious hands. I'm going to, today I'm going to do things, basic things I need to do to live. Damn, basic things I need to do to live got hands. Still need to fight one of those two turkins, so I hope we see more of those uphill. We could get this back in working order. Ugh. I'm glad we could fix the elevator. All right, yeah, god damn, it's, is it just like that? Oh, actually, it's not just like Battle Network, I think. Because in Battle Network, you have to use that the, the button all the time, but I think in this game, it's just that the elevator's not on your floor. Gotta love Xenoblade Party AI when they wig out whenever you stand anywhere. They can follow you pretty well, except when they get caught in something, but man, you stand still, they go like, I can't deal with that. This 
Let's construct it without delay. Certainly won't make trouble. You are on the roof. Phew, I'm so relieved to finally see a friendly face. Good news, the cavalry's here. Come on, we'll take you back with us. I would appreciate that. I've been on my own for days, just wandering. I'm Kathy. I could lift big rocks. I used to work as an engraver. Seriously glad to make your acquaintance. That's a new one. We ought to speak to them now. That's, yeah, that's the quest, right? Yep. Well, this is a good checkpoint. Let's do side quest things. We're getting close with the number of party members. I, I should, when I start a Pokemon as a special case, Eevee. Um, I think they'd walk in front of you when you stopped. I don't think they'd walk in front of you while you were moving. I definitely seem to recall them never doing that. Like, I guess maybe they went a little bit in front of you, but not that far in front. Clarity's got something new to say. I met Dylan earlier. It's such a relief he's safe. I mean, if nothing else, he, the man's a walking armored chestnut. Practically uncrackable, but how sh but wh I should I be worried about him? Haha, <laughs> that's Dylan to a T. But for the record, I think he was pretty worried about you. Uh oh, really? Well, I'll bear that in mind. I hear you and Dylan managed to find the missing children. Remember that time you, me, and Dylan all slipped out of the city to that time to go exploring? Yeah, we did it all stealthy like. So Granddad dragged us back home and gave us a proper earful. Now you're the one tracking people back home. You're doing your granddad proud. And you've become a pretty damn good doctor. Guess you both had a bit of growing up to do, eh? This is pretty rare, right? Oh ho! New remembered stones, you say? Yeah, that's right. Although <laughs> I hate <laughs> I hate that I can't do Matthew's accent because he's the character that talks the most in side quests. <laughs> He's the guy that would be shouting stealth mode at the top of his lungs the entire time. Yeah, that's right. Although we reckon stone is a bit unwieldy f f for the Mo, so we're thinking sheet metal instead. Makes sense, and it explains why you need a metal worker like myself. Well, color me interested. It'll be a good test of my skills. Hmm, but speaking frankly, if I make the metal too hard, it, then it'll also be resistant to delicate carving. Serious? Vax, it's nothing I can't figure out. Leave it to me, and I'll have it made to spec. Once the first one's ready, I'll bring it to the central plaza, alright? Keep a lookout. Good do that. Thanks. Glad to have you on board. Sounds like you have to pay Roche, Kairu. Unless you're in debt. I've been watching someone play Dokapon lately. <laughs> that game, so many shenanigans. Huh? Where does this connect to again? I don't remember. It connects to over there. <clears throat> I feel like this layout of Colony 9 is a little bit different, even if it's ba based on the original. Yeah, because I don't think you ever could go over here, the original. Treasure. Or I just don't remember the original that well. Either or is possible. Play with friends. Do not play with AI. The AI cheats, I've, I've been told. You want to make new Remembered Stones, eh? Yeah, that's the idea. I was hoping you'd be willing to carve the names. Oh, well. 
It's an honor to be chosen for an illustrious task as that, to be sure. Of course, I'll rise to the occasion. I do owe you for the rescue anyway. I'll get my preparations in order. Let's pick this up later, alright? I've been told that the Advanced Wars AI does not cheat as much in Fog of War as it used to. Sure thing. We'll be waiting at the Central Plaza. Ah, there's the man himself. We're all ready on our, on our end now. It still feels like it cheats, though, definitely. Like, in Advanced Wars 1, I got stuck on Wings of Victory. Um, Wings of Victory, Sammy's version, when I was trying to unlock Nell. And that was the map where I just sort of decided I didn't enjoy playing that map. <laughs> And so, I just followed a guide. <laughs> it was especially rude to find out that it was the same as Andy's version of the map, except with like an, an extra two or three units. It's like, God, really? Come on. Ugh. Right, and thanks very much for your help. Well then, shall we get started? Matthew, I really can't thank you enough. Uh, come off it. All I did was get the ball rolling, no more. I never could have come up with an idea like this. You're building the stones outside the city, it's just... There must have been something holding me back subconsciously. I think I was too dead set on wanting to keep the past intact. Right now, though, what the city needs is people who aren't afraid of change. People like you, Matthew. Come on, uh, he is House Vandom. <laughs> come on now, you're making me blush. Well, let me just say this then. Matthew, the city folk can't do without you. Why? <laughs> Where did the last names come from in the city? Because Matthew definitely... I mean, I guess Matthew might have a last name. But Noah certainly didn't. Let's do both together. All the strength I've got to offer, I lay at your feet. Thanks, mate. I feel stronger knowing you're with me. We'll raise a new city. This Remembered Stone is just the first step. Now, don't I? Uh, shield belt. Take deal fifty percent. Deal less. Deal but take less. Just damage dealt. Higher level enemies and. Block rate is important. All right, looking good. His block rate is now 57%. Quests. Now we're looking to follow this quest. One more knock on metal and then we'll be able to finish that step. Let's go see if we can't upgrade some weapons. can, but only once. Well, I guess we're getting Monado 5. Riku did a good job, if Riku say so himself. Stone. We're still not using the better blade stones yet, which is concerning. To 
Studio Shoulder Guns comes from that post-game area, which is also interesting. You're on a five? Exactly. I uh, don't need this. Alright. I can back up where we left off. Here we are. On the move. I want to upgrade everyone's weapon. I want to see if the, there's a visual change at the last level. This is quite rare. Let's not linger on it. Don't let the enemy take the upper hand. It's me, Things, but this looks like a spot where the for Let's a sneak. There is no sneaker it over here. Oh, interesting. There's like a little warning beep. I'm hoping there are other Lyas in this area that we're going to see eventually. Because I re again, I really want to upgrade, but those seem like the most annoying enemies. I'm definitely gonna have to do some grinding off camera, I think, for those enemies in particular. But they only appear in certain weather conditions, so I can't. <laughs> like they only two of them spawn, but like, it's it's so awkward. With focused intent. The outcome was patently obvious. These are our last guys. Oh, I go on a murder rampage anytime I detect a mosquito in the house. Just stop focusing on anything immediately. That mosquito is dead. Although that reminds me, since moving, I do not have a fly swatter anymore. That was nothing. That wasn't even a warm up. Huh. Looks like there's something on top of this rock. I 
I've marked a destination. So it quite wants us to go to the end of that as well. Time for you to get a fly swatter. Uh, don't worry, I've killed I most I honestly tend to have better luck with my hands usually, but yes, I should probably get a fly swatter. That will be my list on my next paycheck. Right. I had to pay taxes on this paycheck because fun fact, if you buy a house before taxes get there, put out, you got to pay the taxes the for the house. The Orion Mountains these days. Yes, that's right. I think. Right, right. Mountains. Hmm. You want to say something? No, just reminiscing a bit. One time I got swallowed up by them. That was one hell of a ride. Huh? Damn, Rex. You're good. You almost had me there for a sec. Oh, a joke. I get it. Hey, are you feeling okay? Your head specifically? Hey, lay off me. I guess it does kind of sound like a fever dream. No, trust me. It was alive. Hey, these are worse. Dead end. Huh? That's weird. We've been following the map quite closely, too. Wait, is this a salvaging point? Yeah, it's gotta be right. We got the markings of a road under the cliff. Better find a way to get down then. What? Down? From here? Don't worry, we have Etherlist to help us. Oh, sorry, don't. God damn it. That was Panacea. Yes, but even so, is that really our only option here? What, you scared, hi? You trembling in your widow boots? Of course I'm scared. What I don't understand is how you seem to be completely unfazed. Glad it looks that way to you, because I'm actually this close to peeing my pants right about now. I did not need to heat that, so me. Wanna stay here then? We can go on ahead. Heh, <laughs> sheer terror ain't enough to stop me when treasure's on the line. That's complete. <laughs> that's a complex kind of bravery. See, that's, that's called stup- uh, I guess it's not called stupidity. Stupidity is when you're not afraid of anything. God, we're running out of black crystals, which is concerning. We should be able to set something up here. <gasps> Great. Let's head down. Oh, it's one of these doors. <clears throat> Actually, is it the same signal? It's a lot. It might be the same symbol as the Hyentia. The mark of the Hyentia. What have we here? Check it out. This is it. It's the same pattern as the sigil. So the treasure is inside here. From the looks of this door, I wouldn't rate our chances of getting it open very highly. You'd think, right? That's where the sigil comes in. Watch and learn. The sigil's gonna resonate and the door will do this mighty rumbling and then... Nothing's happening. Aw, oh, come on. That was a totally a rumbly door moment. I really suggest you take a reality check, Sony. Ugh. Fine. Hi, give me those high explosives you got. You wanna blow the door down? I probably do have enough on me. Hold on. Sami, can you pass highs in the, sig the sigil? Oh, right, because he's a high entia. Huh? Why? Please stop asking questions and do as he says. Uh, okay. Sure, go ahead. I don't afraid of anything except the things that I do. Alright, now what, Shulk? Now stand in front of the door. R right? Oh, 
Oh! What? No way! I thought it might be something like that. I don't... But how? I don't understand. The mechanism probably relied on verifying both the sigil and biological data of its bearer. It was looking for someone with a link to the race who created the sigil, in other words. Brace. I'm afraid I don't follow. Does it matter? We got the thing open! Thanks, hi! You rock! Uh, you're welcome? How'd you figure it out anyway, Shulk? Ah, it was just a hunch I had, based on past experience. I wasn't sure if it would actually work. Ah, I see. Could you guys- <laughs> Oh my god, she's already there! Could you guys dawdle any more? The treasure's right in front of us. Let's move it. Come on, hop up! Now wait, don't run on your own. You see, I had to- I, I managed to open these doors before. It took a lot of side questing to get it done. Spooters! It's treasure! Real, actual treasure! Of mo actual monetary value! Well, they wouldn't, given the world that this takes place in. Got some pests, though. Where'd they slink in from? That hole over there, if I were to hazard a guess. <laughs> Whoa! They think they can get their greedy mitts on the treasure, do they? Yeah, not on my watch patch, they ain't. Have at them, oh esteemed authority figures. They really are incorrigible. It's alright. I could tell where this is going from a ways off. Yes, I do remember that from every single playthrough. Ho ho ho! Time for the big reveal! Drum roll, please! Plat Wait, platinum's a metal. How could it be a platinum jewel? Hey, this is pretty nifty. Could come in useful in a scrap. Uh huh, this is not what I expected. What are you talking about? It's valuable treasure, just like you wanted. Yeah, I get that, but I was hoping for something with a bit more pizzazz, more like bling. La Paz of gold and silver? Yeah, exactly. A riches beyond your wildest dreams kind of thing. Did you look at the size of the chest? And what good would that have to do to us? We'd have no use for it. Oh, well. Far be it from me to turn down an opportunity, golden or, other, or otherwise. Sorry, but we'll be requisitioning this. It's going straight to the Liberator's collective assets. What? How is that fair? I was the one who found it. Come on now, we all contributed here. You should have known this is gonna ha this is how it was gonna turn out, Soomi. All right, you've had your fun. Now, how about you go back to Colony Nine and do some work? Hm. <laughs> work schmirk. A true adventurer laughs in the face of hard labor. You haven't heard the last of this. Next chance, I guess Soomi's coming back with a vengeance. You hear me, Linka? You big jerk. Hey, Somi, wait for me! Wow, she's a regular human whirlwind. Hang in there, Linka. I'm trying, believe you me. Let's go and visit them. Okay! Just leaves. Walls could speak, which I don't think is gonna tell me where to go. All right, jewel beetle gauntlet, damage dealt protecting the side, every aggro every second, damage uh, damage dealt by unity combos. That's probably pretty good, but I'm not gonna use it. 
you're going to say to someone, yeah, worse iron Masago, rabbit stone, white clover, blah, 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 tear amulet, break brooch, brooch, damage from bleed, if only bleed was good, break resistance, okay, let's take a look at our community. Oh, we just gotta talk to them a bunch. Fun medals. Gotta talk to Kathy a lot as well. Clarity, change Dylan's community status, but Dylan is available next. Georgie, this we need one more recipe quest, which I'm assuming is coming. Aizen. Yeah, looks like we've got some community cleanup. Uh, we cannot get Linka or P Panacea. Well... Ruben. Salmi. Heisen, but I think Heisen is changeable already, right? Yeah. Alright! Community cleanup time! Interesting, we got a whole area up ahead. It's gonna be a whole thing! See if they have anything to say. If they don't, we'll, we'll just go through all the people, get them all in the community, which will be good because the more people in the community, the easier it'll be to keep track of the people that aren't in the community. <laughs> We've only got two guys left to find, too. Ruben? Okay, you first, because it looks like you might be walking to bed. So I wasn't the only survivor. That makes me feel a bit better. But there are also children among those who escaped, and they're missing their parents. We'll do whatever it is in our power to keep the children safe and happy. Thank you. I'll try to contribute however possible as well. It's such a relief that the kids who, who are all so well behaved, I think they understand what's going on, you know? It pains my heart to see such innocent things placed in such horrid situation. I know. They're meant to be living their lives somewhere safe, happy, and carefree. I heard Axel and Finley were given a job. I couldn't believe it at first. Yet some of our lot have been given up the will to live, those little troopers. They'll be wanting to reassure their parents, waiting for the day they'll come home. Kids really are something else. Aren't they, though? I must see if there's something I can do for them in return. We may be able to ask them this and that. Matthew, I've decided. I'm going to build an orphanage for the children who survived this terrible ordeal. An orphanage, eh? We have one in the city as well. Might just be what this place needs. Children need to get a proper education, of course, but what they really need most is family. Blood relations shouldn't even come into it. I think we have a duty to foster them and give them the support they need. I'll help you with that. I'm not actually pretty good with kids. Oh, that would be wonderful. Our relations are deep in Community goals, community. Next, Bobby, no. Kathy, yes. Who's, who's, who I think I passed up talking to earlier. It used to be that in, the engraving of the stones was a symbol of recognition given to the master artisans who spent years honing their craft. Oh god, I'm, all, I'm through my water already. We're only halfway done. Now a novice like me has to carry on the tradition. I'm still astonished by it all. I'm sorry, is this getting a, is it getting too much for you? I am feeling the pressure a little, but as someone who takes pride in their work, there is no greater honor. Don't worry, I won't bring shame upon my forebears. The work will be done. You might find this strange, but when I look at Origin, I feel odd not by its size, but by its beauty. Again, perhaps its beauty is such that it inspires a certain dread. Could it really have been man-made? 
I wonder how they're doing. <laughs> I wonder how that person we just talked to is doing. It's quite an honor to be given the task of engraving names in the Remembrance Stones. But as the names add up, it really does start to weigh on you. Hang in there, Kathy. I would dearly hope that the task of engraving your names doesn't fall to me. You are the hopes and dreams of the city, so don't go dying out there. Always happy to help. All right. We're getting up there in community. We've only got two people left, and a lot of there's a lot of gold names. Bobby can't do Bobby yet. Clarity got to change. Dylan. Dylan is next. He's not awake yet. So I heard setting up a replacement remembrance stone in the plaza was your idea. Everyone's been saying how happy they are about it. Some are even calling you their new leader. How about that? Nita, nah, come on, that's a bit much. He really isn't. You know how damn important those slabs are to us. I always knew you were destined for greatness, you know. Looks like I was right on the mark. So keep doing what you're doing and be the be the change the city folk need, eh, leader? We made a connection. Okay, next is Clarity. It's over this away. Probably around here. Yes, binary runs straight into the tent. While I'm here, can I craft any gems? Yes. Decoration. Oh, yeah, yeah, we need to find we need to get more Laya stuff. But we're getting close to to owning every the max gems, which is nice. Anyway. As I suspected, this place could really could really use a doctor or two. I won't lie, I'm glad of the warm welcome. It would have been nice to have encountered them sooner, though. The lives we could have saved. Don't go down that hole. You'll do what you can, and things are going to be that much better from now on, right? Make it sound so simple. Though, yes, I'll get the job done. Recipes. Tyson's next. Jethro should, well, should also be completable. Uh, Lincoln and Panacea are, of course, not. Miguel is not. Riku is not. Ruben and Saomi should be. We're going to have most of the people on this list in our community. I'm also wondering if somebody's going to appear in that middle section. not touch that roguelike mode and to be honest I'm not like too interested by it as much as I think this is, this game's combat is my favorite of the Xenoblade games it's much more of a rhythmic ry like combat in this game has a rhythm to it you get into the rhythm you're gonna do well mostly like I kind of wish I'm curious where they're gonna take Xenoblade combat next because I've, I've always I don't know how I feel about Xenoblade's momentum based battle mechanics because it means if you're in a winning position it's easy to stay in a winning position and if you're in a losing position it's very hard to get out of that losing position 
I never say it to her face, but I'm actually kind of grateful to Selmy. Somehow or other, I always end up being roped into her brain schemes. But it's also given me many opportunities to talk to a lot of liberators freely and openly. Without Selmy, I'd probably just be sitting alone on my own little island. One way or another, she's special. She's a special one. It's a good thing you two made friends, then. <laughs> it is, isn't it? For her sake as well, I hope. We made a connection. Okay. So me, but before so me, I think I need Jethro. Okay. Jethro! As far as I know, the old monster, the old master, <laughs> never once used a blade. If a true master owns his strength unarmed, is the very act of using a weapon uncouth? Hmm, might want to take that out with a pinch of salt. Granddad was kind of a hermit after all. Didn't... I might be misremembering my lord. Didn't Matthew get his gloves from the master? A, wa a wise... Ascetic? Then I must follow in his footsteps and choose the pass of the fists. Fists. They're like metal fists. I wouldn't say that's unarmed. <laughs> Mate, there's really no reason to. I heard about this Alpha. What a horrible thing to have befallen your sister. Yeah, thinking about it, this means the attack on the city was all our fault. Stop. No one is to blame here. I know it's not my place to say, but try not to let it weigh you down, on, weigh you down Matthew. I'll try. We may be able to ask them this and that. Matthew, would you mind having a bout with me? Uh, sure. Let's put this on. I've been training myself from the ground up against the old master's teaching in mind. I was hoping you might see my progress first, before I showed anyone else. Haha, <laughs> wow, you're really stoked about this, huh? <laughs> I'm surprised myself. It's been a long time since I fought, felt the old fighting spirit surging through my veins. Well, good on you. I'm always ready to tussle if you up for it. Alright, Infinity scenes are almost done. I don't know why I went to the enemy PD. We're going through... Okay, so after Jethro... is Linka, who we can't do. After Linka... is Miguel, who we can't do until we've done a quest, but we've finished talking to them, so we should be able to do them soon. Uh, Panacea, we also can't do. Perido, Riku... Ruben... is doable, and then Selmy, and then we'll be done. Ruben is around, but he is on the other side of the... No, he's he's over here. As ordered, I made it so the new Remembered Stones will be fully detachable. You can pop them down and pick them up as many times as you like, till we find a place we can call home. Cheers, Ruben. You did a bang-up job. <laughs> High praise indeed. Well, sooner or later, we're going to have to find something a bit more permanent. I've been getting plenty of requests straight from the Liberators. Can't complain, though. It's keeping these hands occupied. What sort of requests are you getting? Uh, you know, odd jobs. Repairing the soldiers' armor, making steel barricades, that sort of thing. Well, you've been a great help. It really shows when someone's well-versed in their particular trade. Ha ha ha! Oh, you flatterer. I could get used to this. Should probably talk face to face. Yeah, as if we have never talked face to face before. You guys spread the word about my metalworking profession or something? Because I am getting swamped with requests. Levinous armor, pots and pans at the canteen, you name it. <laughs> Damn, I don't envy you. You're gonna be <laughs> I don't envy you, you're gonna be rich. You're gonna be okay. Not sure if okay is the right word, but yeah, I'll be fine. They picked the right man for the job after all. Maybe it's time for me to finally set up my own little workshop. You better enlist my services from time to time. <laughs> 
We made a connection. All right. That's just what saw me. Who's over this way somewhere? You know, Linka's dad sounds like the coolest guy that ever lived. When we were kids, she used to tell me all these stories about the wild adventures he went on with her mom. That's probably what gave me the a wild hair for exploring and treasure hunting and stuff. A thirst for the great unknown. I know where you're coming from, but I have to be straight with you. I know, I know. I'll stay level-headed and not go gallivanting off on my own foolhardy expeditions. I gotcha. But I... Just once before I die, I like to go chasing my dreams, okay? For the record, that part's not negotiable. Don't worry, this world doesn't matter. On that note, I'm gonna go put my bucket list down on paper. Our relations deepen. Oh, yeah, it's unlocked. Another kit. Who would want to unlock? Uh more stuff to try. Having more decks would be nice. Oh wow! I didn't realize Matthew's attack is not that different from A's. Rex is way stronger, though. What's your block rate at now? You're probably gonna cap out at 60. All right. That's the community settled. Let us... Turn... To the Black Mountain.